Hey guys, how's it going? DUJ2 here, and welcome back to Fortnite Save the World. And we don't have any news. <laughs> so this is coming soon video. As you guys know, every single week I do a coming soon video, which usually I try and do the day before we have an update. Uh, oddly enough, though, this week we don't really have much information to go off of. Um, the only thing we have, the only thing we have, uh, is this tweet, this tweet that says slide into patch version 6.01 on Wednesday, October 3rd patch notes will be available when downtime begins at 3 a.m. Eastern. This is actually an hour earlier than normal. Um, and we're going to talk about this in a second. We're going to keep talking about this. Okay. Uh, but first, what we're going to do is we're going to open up some llamas. So as you all know, this llama right here is one of my favorite llamas, the Lucky 7 Llama. And I am going to go ahead and uh, you know what? Why not? Let's open all 10. So we're going to open all 10 of these llamas. And while we open them, we're going to talk about this tweet and kind of what I think is going to happen. Um, so let's take a look at the tweet again real quick. So the tweet says slide into patch version 6.01. I think it's kind of interesting that they use the word slide there. Now, it's also important to think that this is probably, you know, Battle Royale kind of, you know, like, like directed. Uh, of course, most of their tweets, they are kind of uh, referring to Battle Royale stuff. So maybe it's a new Battle Royale mode or something. Maybe everything's going to be covered in slime or ice. I don't know. Uh, but the, I think the most important thing here to look at for us personally is that this is going to be version 6.01. Um, it's not even going to be version 6.1, which is actually really interesting. Now, a lot of us think and know that, you know, we are waiting for, we're waiting for Fort Nightmares. We're waiting for something else to come along. It's only been one week, guys. We've only been in the first week of version 6.0. And honestly, I have to say this, guys. <sighs> wow, that's... A oh, yeah, they're lucky seven levels. Um, so it's seven times. It's... um. I do have to say this. I am kind of surprised that... It feels like hey, this version, nice. this 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 week has been so long. It's only Adios. been one week, guys. We've only had cram session for one week. Uh, it's only the first week of version 6.0, and it really does, it, or version six. And it, honestly, it really does. It feels like it's been forever. Um, I don't know if that's a good thing, guys. I don't know if that's a good thing. I don't know if that's a bad thing. Personally, uh, I kind of. Um, uh, personally for me i'm i'm kind of enjoying cram session you guys know this i'm enjoying the double the double rewards uh at first when i was starting to see you know like the cram session rewards and everything i was kind of like well you know it's not that great it's not that awesome uh but now as we've come we've continued to go along just regular quests the regular quests that have the extra two times you know like uh i i love doing encampments doing encampment missions with double hero experience rewards has been pretty awesome it's actually been really really awesome i've been quite surprised at how awesome the amount of experience i've been getting is and like for example for those of you who watched my video earlier today oh no you guys didn't watch them did you guys i don't know if you did um but on my stream i uh I need uh, I need storm shards. <laughs> I need a lot of storm shards. I didn't realize just how much storm shard I need. And going into Twine Peaks right now, and being able to use you know just being able to harvest uh, encampment missions with storm shard as rewards, it's been really awesome. And of course the double here and everything. So, and of course of course the massive amount of gold that we're getting, which wow. I, I gotta tell you guys, I am I am really shocked and amazed at just how much gold we've been getting in the game, which I kinda hope oh, that if yeah. it's gonna continue, it if in. we're still gonna be in in um, the in the cram well, session, I hope me. that tomorrow they add much, much, much more things to spend gold on and maybe even something that worthwhile like uh, like I said, uh, like Reaper. If they just 
if they were just to sell unlimited amounts of rework, you know, at a considerable price, you know, like decent price, um, it would be awesome because a lot of us are getting a ton of gold just from the regular missions. Well, hello there. So, for me personally, where we are right now in the game, or, or where we are after the first week of version 6, which, like I said, the only thing that kind of surprises me is how long it feels that it's been. I mean, this has been a very long week. And if we have another week of cramp session without any considerable change, like in the shop, or, or something else, you know, change some other adjustment or some of that, Ooh, I do feel sharp. like it's going to get really, really draining for a lot of us. And to be honest, when I look at this tweet and it says slide into patch version 6.01, it's not even version 6.1. I don't know. You never know. You never know. It's possible that they will release Fortnite Nightmares tomorrow, Fortnite Nightmares 2. Yes, I have seen a lot of the stuff that people have said that has been data mined. Uh, for those of you who don't know, I really don't enjoy talking about data mine uh, stuff. But I know it's out there. Um, and what we do know for sure, this is something we do know for sure. We do know for sure that they did say that there was going to be a new hero or... Uh, weapon every single week and from what we've seen like in version 5 it was one week a hero one week a, uh, uh, a weapon and I don't know are we going to see them just in the shop or is it possible that we're going to get a new event for a new hero tomorrow personally for me I'm kind of hoping that we do get some sort of event I hope that we get either some sort of event or, or something we get something that is going to you know bring I don't know what, but I'm really hoping we see an event to save the world. Uh, I at least hope that we're going to be seeing a developer uh, update soon uh, or a developer's roadmap or something, you know, like something like that just to kind of give us, you know, kind of give us a heads up of where we are going in the game right now. And let me just say, this is kind of, have you guys That'll seen this? Have you guys done. been watching? Not a single gold Adios. one. I don't know what happened to my luck. Enjoy. I don't know what happened to my luck guys, but my luck went out the window. Now, I'm a little salty because of course I still want the golden, uh, the gold, the legendary survivors, but I did need some more survivor uh, experience. So I'm hoping that these survivors that I get right now will be enough to get me over. Uh, and then I can do, uh, I can do a video that I've been wanting to do. Hopefully, but, uh, man. Let me know if you guys open these llamas. I love these llamas. I love the, the Lucky 7 llamas. I love the... My favorite llamas, of course, are the 11 times. Because you get more chances to get... Guys, can you believe... Look at this. Not a single... Not a single legendary. 2,800 gold. Was that worth it? Maybe not. Maybe not. I don't know. Anyway. So, let me wrap up with saying this, guys. Uh, so if we want to finish talking about this, uh, oh, what we do know is right there. Yeah, we do know that, that the downtime will be happening at 3 a.m., which honestly is kind of interesting. It's an hour earlier than normal. Normally, we've been seeing it at 4 a.m. Eastern. I don't know if this is some sort of preparation for something they're doing. I don't know if this is something different. Uh, maybe they're hoping to see a, a change or a I, I don't know. I don't know. It, it seems very interesting, guys, that this is going to be happening. But personally for me, um, like I said before, I, I, I'm looking forward to these patch notes. I am definitely going to make a video, guys. You guys know as soon as the patch notes come out, I will make a video. I will take a look at what's going to happen. Um, and right now at this point, guys, I can just hope. Uh, seeing that it's going to be it's a client update, uh, a version 6.01. Oh, oh, it's a client update. Look what it says there. It's a client update. Interesting. So is the client update at 3 a.m. and then the patch update at 4 a.m.? That, I don't know. I don't know. But regardless, guys, um, I'm hoping that whatever happens, we do get a significant change in the game, either a new event. We are obviously going to have, I, I believe it's going to be a new hero. And I also think that we're going to get, of course, we're going to get a new returning weapon or hero. I don't know. It might be a hero, it might be a weapon. Um, it should be interesting. 
It should be sweet. Wh whatever the case, we will have a little bit of new stuff to spend, you know, gold on. But like, like right, right now, I'm sitting on almost four thousand gold already. Man, it, it comes back so fast. So hopefully, hopefully, guys, I'm hopeful. I'm hopeful that this next week will bring something really exciting for us. But again just because we haven't really had that much communication from them for a while we haven't really had any you know developers roadmaps or anything it's kind of hard to see where we're going with the game but regardless I'm still going to stay positive and i'm going to hope we're going to see something really awesome so thank you very much for watching guys as always i am duj2 i will see you guys in the next one thank you very much and have a good night guys see ya